saw you, you know, facilitated a little more this game with seven assists. How did you uh, feel like you had a feel for the game on that end? Um, I just felt like uh, today was more of a, not as offensive as I could be. Um, the other games I was feeling really hot. This game, I feel like um, I, I seen driving lanes and I see that we needed buckets. So uh, when they help, I'm definitely gonna kick it to my guys and I have full faith and trust in them that they're gonna make the shots. And um, we didn't make all our shots, but I believe in us and I believe next game we'll be able to do better. And then, I mean, maybe it's as simple as not making your shots, but as a whole, uh, what do you think what really went wrong uh, in this game for you guys to lose? I just think our toughness wasn't as high as it should be. We came out first half, great intensity, great toughness. Second half, that's where we got to work on our most. That's why um, our few losses that we have came in the second half, really. Um, I just feel like we need to be able to learn how to close out games. Uh, we've been there in every game that we lost. Um, we just need to get tougher, um, not give up shots, and be able to close games out. Did they uh, look to, you know, guard you a little harder than you, you've seen so far this year? You think they keyed in on you a little more than other teams have so far? I mean, every team's going to probably do their scouting reports. They're probably going to know this guy can do this, this guy can do that. They watch film. They know my strengths. Um, I feel like they, they did guard well, but I still have other aspects of my game that, um, that I can go to. Um, sometimes my shot wasn't there. I, I missed a few shots in the second half. I realized that. And I just went to uh, trying to get some assists from my guys, trying to get us still in the keepers in the game. Thank you, Nigel. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Next question to Kellis Robinette. Hey, Nigel. You, uh, if I'm correct, I think you scored seven points pretty early in the game, and it took you a while to find the, you know, find the net again. Uh, just what went into that? Were they doing something different, or were you just looking to pass at that point? Uh, I just missed some shots, and I mean, everybody's going to miss shots. Uh, I didn't want to force it. I mean, we were down. I wanted to get us back in the game. I realized that it wasn't me that was scoring that. My other guys were hitting shots. DG was hitting shots. Mike was hitting shots. Uh, so I felt like I needed to find those guys, and they were helping, um, doing a great job helping on the drives. So I feel like I, it was good for me to look for my guys uh, to get us back in the game until I found some rhythm back again to start shooting again. You guys all talked about how, you know, beating UMKC, you want to start a winning streak, seem like a step in the nice direction. Is this game a step back in your mind? No, I don't think anything's ever going to be a step back. Um, I feel like we're always going to keep moving forward. I mean, if you lose, it's not really a loss. It depends on how you take it. Um, a loss can be a win. We can learn from this. We can pick up things. And we still got a, a long season ahead of us. I mean, it's still very early. We still got some things we can learn. And every loss, we can pick up some new things and, and put it in our game so we can become better. All right, thanks, Nigel. No problem. Next question to Ryan Black. Oh, sorry, I didn't say it already on Nigel. Uh, uh, I, I guess my question is to piggyback off what you were just asked, uh, though, Nigel. I mean, I, I assume, you know, coming from where you came from, you know, you're, you're not a guy really accustomed to losing many games. So how do you, uh, how, how you kind of keep your, your head up when, uh, when things like this happen? I mean, we always, I always face adversity. Um, that's that's my biggest challenge. Um, I knew adversity would happen coming here. I mean, everywhere I go, there's going to be adversity. Um, I picked the school for a reason. I have full confidence in us. I have full confidence in my coaches. Um, it's a little rough start. I mean, the basketball season is going to be a roller coaster. Right now, we're going, we're going, uh, we're going down. But right now, we're going to go back up at some point, And I believe fully in us. Um, we got another game Tuesday. So right now we're going to get our minds straight and get our minds ready for, for the next game on Tuesday to start another win streak. 